This is an immensely exciting day for us because Rocket has returned to uh, Manchester and to the site for which it was created. This museum, the Science and Industry Museum, is located at the original Manchester terminus of the Liverpool to Manchester Railway, this first groundbreaking railway that connected the world's first industrial city, Manchester, with the port of Liverpool. This is the first time that Rocket has been back to Manchester in over 180 years. It was built for the Liverpool and Manchester Railway and ran there um, until it was sold in 1836 and it hasn't been back to Manchester since. This locomotive is what I like to call the, the father of all steam locomotives. It um, sets the blueprint for the way that steam locomotives were built um, from this point onwards. Rocket is an iconic piece of British engineering and it hits you as soon as you come in the door. It's, it somehow sits well in the space. We've also got some, some lovely exhibits on display that help set the scene. It took us three and a half days to get it out of Newcastle and then it came across the Pennines on the back of a truck. As part of looking after Rocket and its journeys, it was covered up and covered in polythene to make sure that the rain couldn't get through to Rocket. From there, it was craned off another truck and brought in through a lot of effort from our colleagues and contractors to get it inside the building. So taking the chimney off and on Rocket is actually quite a major task in itself. Uh, obviously we're talking about a, a, an object that is 189 years old. It's a lot of lifting equipment and people positioned at either end and another colleague of mine actually fed into the inside of Rocket to be able to take the bolts off from the inside. And that consisted of uh, raising the chimney up onto the um, top of the uh, boiler seating it into position and inserting 18 bolts and nuts into the top of the boiler. To think of you know, one of, sort of Stevenson's engineers actually fitting the chimney exactly the same as, as we had to is quite, quite amazing really. Having been at Rain Hill, uh, celebrations, 150 year celebrations, uh, I really wanted to see the real uh, locomotive as opposed to the replica. It's good and I'd like to come back and see it again. That first day when I came in and saw it standing in the entrance hall looking so dramatic uh, was, a, was a, a really emotional moment for me actually. It really felt like a special, special occasion. Rocket has been on display in the Science Museum in London for many years now, but we've recently shown it at the Great Exhibition of the North in Newcastle, where it's wowed the crowds. And it's here with us for a year, a precious year, and after that it will go on to the National Railway Museum in York.